The city and its people change their appearance over time. When I visit my old town for the first time in a long time, I see new buildings in familiar places. There's something fresh about nostalgia, isn't there? The exact same place can look different in different times. This Yukioki is 36 views of Mount Fuji Edo Nihonbashi by Katsushika, Hakusai. And here is the current Nihonbashi. You can see that things have changed quite a bit. It is fun to compare them like this and think about the people and history of the past. Today, we would like to introduce a fun way to enjoy Yukioi, such as comparing the present with the past of the places where Yukio works are set in Takumi, Japan. Katsushika Hakusai and Yudagawa Hiroshig each painted Yukio Mi featuring Nihonbashi. The history of Nihonbashi is very old, dating back to 1603, the beginning of the Edo period. It is said that the bridge was built when the town of Edo was newly divided and improved. The name Nihonbashi comes from the fact that people from all over Japan gathered to build the bridge. Or it is said that although it was not given a name, everyone mysteriously began to call it Nihonbashi in the same way. The five streets also originate from Nihonbashi, making it the very center of Japan. The Hokkaido Five Routes is a series of five overland highways developed in the Edo period 1603 to 1867, starting from Nihonbashi and extending to all parts of Japan. Now then, let's look at Hakusai's Nihonbashi first. This was painted around 1830, which means that it depicts a scene from at least 300 years ago, since Edo Castle is located here. According to documents from that time, People were constantly passing over the bridge, and boats were constantly passing. There are seven boats on the river in this Yukiovi, and if you follow the boats and look at the back, you can see Edo Castle. Also, to its left is MT Fuji. Nihonbashi Bridge is depicted in the foreground of the picture, but you can see it is filled with people. It shows how vibrant the town of Edo was. Now, what does it look like today, some 200 years after it was painted? Currently it looks like this. The wooden bridge has been replaced by a stone bridge, and a highway hangs over the bridge. Therefore, neither Edo Castle nor MT Fuji. In addition, the Edo Castle Tower was destroyed by the Myriki Fire in 1657, and has not been rebuilt since then. If Hakusai were around today, he might have painted a different Nihonbashi. In case you are wondering, the highway is currently under construction and will be open to traffic in 2035, followed by the removal of the upper roadway over the next five years. It may be a bit far off, but once the highway is gone, we may be able to see again a landscape similar to the one painted by Hakusai. Next, Yukioi painted by Hiroshig Yudagawa. This one was painted in 1833, the same year as the Hakusai one mentioned above. This one depicts Edo in the morning. The sun will be up in a few minutes, and the sky is turning colors with the morning glow. The procession of daimyo on the daimyo's journey to the capital can be seen in the center of the image, suggesting that the scene here was not painted in 1833, but rather before that time. The procession of daimyo is a procession taken by feudal lords when they go out, with their attendants. The fishmonger is crossing in front of the screen. They seem to be carrying fish purchased from the market early in the morning. Even before the sun rises, you can tell this place is alive with activity. Well, here is the current situation. Compared to the past, today's traffic seems to be dominated by cars, and bridges are getting wider. The highway is still visible from here. Across the bridge on the left is Nihonbashi Mitsukoshi, and behind it is Koreto Muromachi, etc. On holidays, the street is so busy that you have to walk around to avoid people. Nihonbashi has been, and continues to be a place where many people come and go. The Yukioi presented today all depict scenes from a time before they were painted. 
people of that time must have looked at it and thought of scenes from the past. Today we can think of two eras, the era depicted in the painting and the era in which the painting was painted. And from a foreigner's point of view, you will enjoy the exotic and mysterious culture. This was an introduction to Yukioi, which can be enjoyed in such a variety of ways. You can purchase the work introduced in this video directly from Takumi Japan Shop website. We also have a great selection of other works. Please check the link in the description for detail.